Hello everybody, welcome to a new modern video. Uh, we're playing uh, the Prowess, the Prowess uh, deck with uh, Soska Mage, Monster, Swiss Spear, Dragon's Ray Channeler, and the Spray Dragon, one of the uh, cheaper options in modern, although I am splashing a collar, but I guess that doesn't really make it more expensive, it's just a couple of Secret Foundry. Uh, for uh, Prismatic Ending, very important, one of the best ways to kill Sanctifier and Vec, as well as Pathway Exile, another way to kill Sanctifier and Vec, Hammer, Murktide, and then Wear Tear, super important card in Modern, one of my favorite cards against Ursa Saga decks. It's just so natural that you 2 for 1 with this card, or just 1 mana trade with um, Ursa Saga. Uh, 6. One mana counter spell for the Cascade decks. I used to play Ether Gust in my guy for Channel Fireball. This list comes from uh, uh, Fracom, uh, who uh, I believe finished in top 24 in Prague. Uh, but again, the list is super similar to the one I wrote about. I think I had two light up the stage over the Unholy Heat, and then I had uh, two Ether Gust over the Spell Pierce, and that was the same list. Ether Gust can be sided in against. Uh, I don't know. It's it's fine. Spell piece is also good. Uh, but yeah, uh, we are we have Underworld Breach. This is uh, one of the uh, Underworld Breach deck that uh, tries to go off with Breach plus Channeler. You have eight free spells with Mutagenic Growth and Mishra's Bubble. Uh, yeah, not much else to say about this deck. I think the list has been refined, and I think that uh, at the it's it's performing with the White Splash these days. Buenos dias, chat. Primo, Daniel, Sebastian, everybody. All right, just between us today, I I didn't set the alarm. Somehow, I my alarm. Uh, I don't know. Last night, I went to bed and my alarm wasn't set. I didn't check. So I I woke up this morning and I was like. Oh, I feel very rested, but it's still not 8 a.m. That's weird. Let me check the phone. And the phone said like 8.44 and I'm like, what? So yeah, I, slept, I casually slept 44 extra minutes this morning. So I am very much more rested. I had to rush everything to be on time. Still not really on time, because it's like 10 minutes late, but, so I just like to take things uh, slowly in the morning, I don't wanna, I don't like to rush. Alright, Nitrox, GLGL Nitrox, would you like to play first? Yes I would, here's a Giganta, and here's a Medium Hand, keep. There's a very meaty man. I think I just go fetch and go here. I don't want to go top land because I might. They might just play Ragavan and I need to lava dart it. And I don't want to play bubble. I need to pump the spray dragon. This is this is a different deck. It's not Merktide. Gatsa did not wake me up. It did, did not. No. All right, Sparbluff Canal. Sparbluff can all go, very scary. I'm not moving here. Sparbluff can all go might mean consider, but also can mean probably removal spells, and I don't want to trade two mana for one. Oh, it's not. Okay, they got me good. They got me very good there. I never thought about a living end. Ay ay ay. I guess I'm glad I don't have ether gas because that doesn't work against leaving in. I 
I, w I was waiting to draw mutagenic growth if I was playing against uh, Blur and Merc Tide. I think not much really, not much really to say here. I just have to hope my opponent uh, doesn't go for it, and I kill them into attacks. Yeah, it really is what I have to do here. So this is four, and then I'm also going to mutagenic growth this. And that's it. I've done everything I had to. No prison borrower? Sure, I mean, no cascade, uh, no cycler cascade. Yeah, there are nine, and again, I hope that uh, they don't draw a cascade spell, and I, they don't have a cascade spell, and I, you know, top deck a bolt and win. Hello, Link Mine. You want to see the Ratadabric standard deck in action? I don't know, it's strange for me, because I, I don't think that there will be many people interested in watching standard content on Magic Online. We talked about it on the podcast, actually. I'll see. I'll see what to do. For now, I'll stick to the most popular formats for my YouTube channel. Alright, yeah, they go for Cascade. Actually, not the huge Cascade spell, so maybe we can still win. Like, pressuring them so much that they had to go for Mini Cascade rather than cycling more. Alright. Draw. Let's see. Something. DRC. Okay. Fortunately, I don't have a fourth caller to ending this next turn. Kinda awkward to play Chandler now since I have to go like Chandler. And then I have to. Like, they just don't attack here. And then I have to chump attack. I guess Chandler sets me up for the. For the top deck of Underworld Breach. I might play some standard just as a test, but I don't know. Anytime I go different than uh, Modern and Legacy, it's not really great. Alright, they decided to attack with both. I guess they have an answer for this. Alright. Maybe they have a Tawara. Breach? No breach. Let's play Swift Spear. Then I'll play Ending. Oh, is this a subtlety? Mm. I, uh... uh, bottom. Then I want to go prismatic ending just to surveil. And uh, attack. They don't block, it's over. Alright, they block. Do I have an out here if I love it, R2? Down to seven. I don't think so. I'm just gonna pass. Oh, actually, let me play a land. Alright, doesn't matter because I can't even fetch this land if they attack me.
But not having a one drop was huge here. Plus on turn two I played around the uh, removal spell so I didn't play my Sprite Dragon. Alright, I have no outs now. GG. Okay, so let's go to game number two. Living at is always scary. I mean, uh, I put it so high in my power ranking because I believe it's such a strong deck. It's not very much respected, but it's, it's a very scary deck. Okay, so this is easy. Actually, let me open my cyber guide on CFP Pro. Prowess. Moving forward, I will have uh, up to three free article a month, not just one like in the past. Since the CFB Pro is still only for uh, Americans and it doesn't seem to be changing very, very soon. Okay, I didn't like... Um, Yes, I had four, four flosses from one surgery to Ether Gust in my load list. I was only bringing in the surgery, I guess, instead of the spell Pierce. So this five, and then I have to bring one extra card. I guess I can, yeah, Lava. I mean, Lava Dart can make me fat. Can, 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 can. Yeah, I guess I can take out Expressive Iteration. Is the record supposed to be hidden? No, sorry, no. It's just that yesterday MTG bot didn't work. So I had uh, this thing. I, I I manually made it and that was hiding it. But today MTG bot seems to be working, so we're all good here. No need to fart to exile. No, definitely not. Then again, the reanimates three or four creatures at a time. If your plan is to kill them all one at a time, you're not gonna win. All right, uh, keep this hand. I think I'll go Soul Mage and just bubble immediately because hitting the second land is very important here. What do I think about Modern Merfolk? Not a fan. What do you want, All right, they have the heads on top of the deck. All right, draw two cards. Hopefully there is a fetch land among them. There is not. Yeah, when the uh, third path iconoclast was printed, actually, that's what brought back this deck. Then people realized it was better with uh, Sprite Dragon and Underworld Breach. Third path iconoclast is the um, yeah, Pyromancer. So. All right, let's hope to draw a land now. Ed, you draw a cyber card, but you draw a cyber card, but the the mana is so bad. How many sources we have? Not very many, right? Yeah, Chain Clan, thirteen blue sources. Not many. A bottom. Let's see if they have a third land. What are the other options for the dragon slot? You can play more wine drops like Ragaman. That's that's probably something you can do as well. Just put Ragaman. Mm. 
Wow. They don't have red land. That's cool. Okay. I can draw a blue land now. And pass. Still flyers? Yeah, two. Okay, looks like they don't have a red land. Blue, nice. Oh, this one, each one pumps for three, so I have seven damage. I have seven damage. The opponent draws like a fetch land, that will take three so I can kill them. Hello, Wanderer. Okay, they go to set they go to nine. They dub every movie in Italian. I could go Sprite Dragon, but my opponent probably has subtlety, so let's just don't move and attack. And play this post-combat. Because if you play this pre-combat, you play subtlety. Endurance. Okay. You target your own graveyard? <laughs> no. You target my graveyard? Sure. How big is mutagenic growth make that thing a 4 or 5? So yeah, let's do it. Do I wanna... Yeah, I think I actually... Oh, never mind. I don't have, I don't have the RC in play. Alright, so that's a 4 or 5 and trades with Endurance. Or rather, kills the Endurance. Okay. And then I'll play this guy. And pass. Keeping up the Flash Storm. Once again, Svelpius, as I said many times when playing uh, Blur and Merc died, because Kate decks can easily play around Svelpius, or Slot System is much different. The difference between 2 and 3 mana up is, is huge when playing against Cascade, because now Slot Storm on a Cascade spell is mana leak. Alright, they're playing the Outburst main. Resolve. And now we're gonna Slot Storm. And they can't really respond. That's why you should play four. I understand it's expensive and blah blah blah, but it really gives your gives you a much better game. Cause yeah, this situation happens all the time. Did a cascade with two mana up. Lightning bolt. Well, that's good. Target, so they have to pay three. For example, if they had one more mana, I could have played Mugenigro first and then plus a storm to make it X equal four. So, is this lethal? It seems like it. So let's just go attack, attack, bold. Mutagenic growth. Even as Felpius in case they have Otawara. Sorry, a uh, Brazen Barber. All right, very cool. We 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 both stumbled on mana. I didn't have blue mana. They didn't have red mana, and I guess thankfully I drew it before they did. 
when RCQ with Merc die, congrats. What will be the scammer time video out? The scammer time video, I made it yesterday. I think it's planned for Thursday. Thursday or Friday, I have to double check. All right, uh, yeah, let's go. I think today, yeah, my mango schedule. Let's go to YouTube Studio. So yesterday we had the Legacy Just Get Control deck. Today I have, uh, let me go, let me check. Today I have Oopso Spells, Tomorrow Zoo, the day after, Hummer Time. <laughs> That's the schedule for my next YouTube video. One a day at 6 p.m. European every day. All right. Uh... I think I keep. This is very explosive and I don't know. I don't feel like mulliganing. Bro. Let's go land the RC bubble. I pass. Endurance. Good to know. Very good to know. I guess I could have taken out the Underworld Breach if I knew they had Endurance, which I did. I like to play mutagenic growth to dig for uh to dig nah I don't think so. Let's just draw. Hello Mark. Alright, so let's play Swift Spear and then I'll start uh, pumping it. Keeping up the one blue mana, very scary. If I was my opponent. Do I have lethal? Let's see, aren't lethal? Yeah, well, yeah. Do I have um, delirium? I don't. Yeah, I think I like to just to just do this now. When I hit delirium. Nice, I did. Just applying pressure. That's ten damage. On turn two. Ah, so I'm gonna keep up the counter even though I don't have it. You're, this Saturday, what do you play? Tameshi Bloom? Oh. Yeah, my problem is that I had to play this on turn one. Because I didn't have a land. I had to play this plus bubble because I didn't have a land. That's why I know that it's better to play Soulscar Mage. Is it gonna go well? No, likely, yeah. That's most tournaments though. You usually lose in Magic tournaments. Okay, they have a third land. They can't play Cascade card or can also, they can also play Endurance, so we'll see. All right, they play shardless. Unfortunately, I don't have anything. Do they have flyers? Yeah, they have one flyer. I have two flyers though with the sprite dragon. And they have ender and sin and steel. Huh? You're up. Love it, art. Okay. Do I go iteration? Do I go sprite dragon? Nah, I think I go iteration. 
Hopefully finding a land. So I can play Source Car and Chum Block. Not looking good. Yeah, I'm playing Sleep again. Oh wow, Force of Negation. Crazy. Yeah, yeah I guess I'm dead now because I have to Chum Block. Ah, GG. Yeah, I mean, what am I supposed to do? Mulligan every hand that doesn't have one of the six counters? I don't think so. If they just have the nuts, turn three, cascade spell, I lose. Hello, Falcom. Draw. Land. So there was a land on top. How much damage is this? Oh, they, they, they didn't even have endurance in hand. Alright, I already concede. I don't think it was 8 damage, but it was uh, 5, I think. Whatever is your two tournaments. Yes. Let's go Toxic 1990. Could have played Great White Toxic. Strong hand. I'll bosh from the mountain. This deck does need both blue and white, so. I need to keep the two. A rare land. Maybe three mountains too many in this deck. Three color deck, playing three mountains, I think it's too much. One more fetch land, never hurt. Still have plenty of uh, fetchable lands with uh, three steam vents or two steam vents. Three steam vents, two saber foundry, two mountains. Yeah, I would I would make this change. Next time. Basic Swamp, that could be the yeah exactly the 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 mono black deck. Alright. They start with a two for one. Okay. Okay. Swiss Spear attacking pass opponent at twenty one. We usually grow right off the top after my opponent played a damage spell. Classic. When I played against Prowess and I landing bolt their Swiss Spear, they, they they always have this. <laughs> Alright, you're all. Iteration. Yeah, uh, so this is 3, 6, 10, 11. Yeah, let's pass the turn. If I had two, which is any, I mean, most of us probably have one, but I don't. Feel that ruin, okay. And they're gonna get the Cabal Coffers here. Next turn they have 5 mana. Draw step. Hmm. This is only sorcery. Yeah, I don't want, want to bolt them. Do I want to bolt them? Is it valuable to bolt them here? Maybe.
pick up Giganta, attack and pass. They get Cabal Coffers. I made a video with Mono Black uh, the other time and uh, it was uh, surprisingly good. Surprisingly good. The new list with no thoughts is, I think it's, as I titled the video, finally a good list of that deck. Every, every, I never played that deck before because I always felt like, you know, not great, but now it's kind of refined. Knights, Whispers, and Dominations and such. Alright, they go feel the Ruin. They want to they wanna kill my blue sources. Alright, I get it. Push my Swiss spear. That sucks. I could have thrown this mutagenic growth earlier, but I feel like the thing is that if you draw an additional mutagenic growth, sorry, an additional monastery Swiss spear, then these mutagenic growth are um, doubling the plus two plus two you get you. Cabal coffers. And they pass, they have three cards in hand, they probably don't have payoffs just yet. They try their best to strip blue mana away, but I managed to find it. Okay. Uh I think I like Gig I think I like the lane for Gigantha. I definitely like the Dragon's Ray Channeler. Hmm, maybe I don't like the lane for Gigantha. Yeah, maybe I don't. I'll just get, I'll just get the RC and then go love at art end of turn. I couldn't have a lot of mana, although they had a lot of mana last turn and still didn't do anything. So they probably need to top deck something. Yeah, prismatic again with more colors. Castle, okay, they have, they, let's see, six, they have nine mana. Let's see what they do with it. They play Domination to begin. I love a dart. What's on top? Lightning Bolt. I don't think Lightning Bolt is good here. Yeah, unfortunately, don't feel very good about this game. Opponent will Profane Tutor for... I don't know anything. Draw. Breach. Where's my breach? I still believe if I draw a breach, probably win the game. Although, they just tutored a card, could be anything. They have 11 mana, so they can go Karn into a 7 drop. Let's see. Worm coil. Okay. Put you on the mic. Bridging coming. Unfortunately, my opponent uh, knows how to play with car and didn't get bridge, but got worm coil engine. <laughs> All right. Uh, let me dart you again. I know it means nothing, but maybe if I draw a other bridge now. Breach. Oh. Not conceding because there's still a chance.
Fortunately, I can't prismatic ending the worm coil. They didn't make six colors in magic. And go. Six, you gain six. And you pass. All right. Uh, yeah, deck thinning end of turn. Although it puts me to exactly six, so maybe it was not the best the deck thin end of turn. Let's draw underwear breach. Come on, underwear breach. Uh, I guess I can go Giganta block. Of course, it's never gonna work. They're gonna have something and I lose, and that's okay, unfortunately. Uh, my draws weren't exciting. Yeah. Surprised you didn't do this in your turn, honestly. Feel the rolling. All right, I shut off my blue mana. <laughs> but I think they have big. I have bigger problem than than shutting off blue mana. That's the spurs. Okay. All right, uh, officially dead. GG. Next draw would have been an holy heat. Ah, kills the vermicoil. coil under a breach. We'll never know. Magical line says you can only see the next card, not the next two cards. All right, do I want the alpine moon? Hmm. Hmm. Doesn't sound exciting, but maybe better than. Uh, yeah, prismatic ending sounds pretty bad. An only heat. I guess only heat can kill Karn. Yeah, maybe I can do something like this. Yeah. Spepius now is slightly better than uh, Flusset Storm since they, 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 they have like Planeswalkers and and things like that. All right, I love to draw creatures. Creatures heavy hand is very good with this deck. Mutagenic seems bad. Okay, I can see that, yeah. I can see the Mutagenic is bad. Swamp Relic. And the Taffer one. I don't know what I can draw to kill them next turn, but I have a lot of damage right now. Just not Swiss for me? Okay. Alright, let's go for it. Upkeep, mutagenic growth. Again, I have no idea how much damage I have. I'm just clicking the buttons and see at the end magical land will count for me. I don't want land, thank you. Upkeep, lava dart you. Upkeep, lava dart you. I don't want land, thank you. Upkeep, Lava Dart you. Hey, there are three lands on top of my deck. Okay, I guess a natural draw. Spell, please. Sprite Dragon. Again, I have no idea how much damage is this, but I'm clicking all and attacking here. Pass. Okay, you're not dead. I was hoping to draw a lightning bolt to kill you, you with three surveil cards, but I uh, didn't get there. That's okay, still a pretty good board state for turn three. Let's see if they die or if they have uh, engineered explosives for one, would be devastating. Domination costs four. Hmm. 
Moth is for blockers. Okay, they correctly the read the eat the relic, so that's a good sign. Unfortunately, I don't even have lethal, so I have to draw a spell. Explosives for oh, they drew explosives off of relic. That's good. All right, any spell, please. <laughs> All right, that plays. <laughs> that's funny. The Underworld Breach with Empty Graveyard, the most uh, threatening card in Magic. I think this is a good screenshot. Bond Breach, too good. <laughs> uh. Yeah, Aldor Breach won me the game. I was looking for it desperately game one to win on the spot, but it never showed up. It showed up on game two to win on the spot. Alright, I don't want to change anything. The, I don't know where Tear kills explosives, but so does ending. Maybe I hate Alpine Moon. Yeah, let's just do this. Okay, let's go. So fifteen dollar cards for nothing, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, swamp relic, that means that my DRC is gonna struggle. I think I'll still play it. And pass. I think I'll still play it and pass. My opponent has Relic, so it's unlikely to just kill this. And then I want to go Swiss Sphere Bubble as well as triggering those. Lethal? Uh, yeah, sometimes I block the word lethal. Sorry. Okay, do I want to bolt up keep? Uh, no. I, draw, I hope not to draw land. Okay. Okay, let's go Mountain, Swift Spear, Bubble. Auto Yield, Auto Yield. All right, let's begin. Let's begin milling those lands, shall we? So the best sequencing here, if you have an ace creature and a non-ace creature, is you play the non-ace creature first. I guess that's more relevant with... Uh... Okay, they might have Fatal Push, so I'm waiting on this mutagenic growth. I'll just bolt you first. Looking to get Delirium. So that they have to crack the... Alright, I have Delirium. I'll uh, bubble myself. If it's a bad card, I might play this mutagenic growth. It's not, it's not a bad card. I don't mind running that. So I, I have the Lyrium, so I'll attack for seven. Hopefully, the Fighter push. They cracked the Relic to stop me from having the Lyrium. Okay, now I'll, I'll let this resolve. I actually can't have the Lyrium, but I only have three types. Land, creature, and artifact. That's okay. You take five. I'm waiting on this mutagenic growth. A, I pass. Draw the... The Soska Mage. And then bobble you. In upkeep. But turn to Delirium. That's pretty good. Alright, they have another of these. I don't care. I can feel it running, okay. The reason why I picked up Soul Scare Mage is that they might go explosives now. So I need more threats. My point is on 12 and I can deal uh, some serious damage here. 
next turn. Yeah, exactly. Explosives are one. Let's attack. For two. And then I think I'm just passing here. Okay, now I guess I have the I could cast this Oscar Mage now. I thought it would wait until the end of turn. Yes, yeah, so I'll play Oscar Mage, I'll play the stopped and pass to you. We played Buddha Foothills. Maybe that was better, because I can't play around them destroying this. Yeah. I was thinking it wasn't relevant, but I guess my opponent is doing exactly that. Maybe casting a second uh double uh two mana card next turn and the next phase and now I don't have spell peers. Or as I played with the foothills I could have. <laughs> That's annoying. Okay, it's a super faint tutor. Fine. All right, draw. Draw. DRC. Okay. Attack. Couple of choices here. One is to pick up Gigantha. But I, I think at this point I need to keep up the spell appears. I think I'm just going DRC pass, keeping up spell peers over Gigantha. Of course, this one can get Domination, so let's think about that. Okay, fifth land. Yeah, I prefer to play DRC than, keep, than returning Gigantha. Because, like, they had Damnation in their deck, so I need to keep a spell piece now. All right, you go for Blood Chief Thirst. Uh, yeah, I can't do anything about it. That, that was a good draw. Well, maybe I had it already. I don't know. I'm not cracking the fetch land. That's important. If I crack it for Steam Vents, they can, they can just Demolition Field it. Draw. Okay. Bubble. And attack for two. Return Gigantha. I guess I can. Um, no, I don't. I don't need to bubble. I can bubble myself and look turn. I sort of don't want to bubble me now and I fetch because again they have this um, field of ruin effect. I think it was, yeah, it was more valuable to play around Domination there. It doesn't seem like a game I'm winning, unfortunately. But there's always Underworld Breach in my deck. Win is playing pretty well around Spell Pierce, I would say. Josh Romita just didn't have spells, so. They took? I don't know, actually, yeah. It's a, it's a demonic tutor, so you don't know what they take. Pretty happy to see that this card is playable in modern. Demonic tutor is such a fun card. Making combo decks more consistent. Still, they're not consistent in modern, but... With the, the one with the Profane Tutor, I mean. But it's fun. That, that gets played. Alright, opponent just passes. Wow. Okay. I'll uh, bubble... Uh, do I want to bubble myself? Yeah, if it's a bad card, maybe I shuffle. Pfft, that's an awful card. Yeah, how about I just take a... Take a land here. 
I don't want to draw a prismatic ending ever. March equal five, wow. I can't even mute J grow this. All right, you got it. 16 bins. And hope to top deck breach, expressive iteration, you know, mega cards. Okay. Okay, uh, Laura. How many Steam Vents have I have in my deck? One more. Mm. Allora. Let's do the good things now. <laughs> Can I cast double? Man, I have no idea what to do. This is a difficult turn. This is a difficult turn, so let's go. Underwear Breach. Now, I'll go DRC. Actually, yeah, no, I think I think I have to start with DRC. 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 DRC, DRC, mutagenic DRC, growth. If I go DRC, DRC, I leave a bubble in the graveyard. I go Mutagenic Grow, mill two cards, and then I can chain a bunch. I think I can chain a bunch. So let's go DRC, DRC. Leaving bubble in the graveyard. And then I go Mutagenic Growth. Mill two. Play bubble. Mill two. No, actually. It's not enough. I guess I can I can spell pierce the mutagenic growth. I can go mutagenic growth. I can go DRC. Leaving bubble in the graveyard. Let me take a stack of cards. Sorry. Oh lord. I have uh, one bubble in the graveyard only now, and I have two uh, DRC in play. I play mutagenic growth. Mill two cards. I spell pierce it. Sorry, I play mutagenic growth, mill two cards. I spell pierce it, mill two cards. Now, now I have six cards extra in the graveyard. So I can go bubble, delve three, mill two. Yeah, I think I think this is good. Okay, let's go. Now, uh I'll play DRC, milling everything above exiling everything about bubble. Done. Now I'll play Mutagenic Growth, Hold Control. Hold Control. So hold priority. And spell Pierce the Mutagenic Growth. And now I can auto yield this. And I just have to bolt a, a, bolt a graveyard everything now. So this is get this gets countered. And now it's just bubble. And if you think it was lethal with with uh, monastery Swiss spear, it's not because if you don't have the DRC in play. It's, you can't do all the things I'm doing if you don't have the DRC in play, okay? All right, love it, Art. It's reasonable, too. So I love it art with flashback. Ooh, Millboard Love It Arts. Nice. Then I can play Bubble. I 
Any more love at arts? Turn, this turn is taking a while now. I might still lose, but uh, at least I'm having fun. Okay, that's the fourth lava dart. Let's see, let's keep in second mountains. How many mountains have left in my deck actually? One, two. Hmm. Do I wanna stop? Do I wanna stop? I don't know, maybe. Maybe I want to stop here. I mean, how many cards am I drawing? I don't even know. How do you operate to a magical line? Control. You click control. Actually, I didn't need it because I had the trigger from, from DRC. Anyway, if I love a dart again, I put two more cards in the graveyard. That might be good enough. Because if I blow up all my lands, my opponent even have this. And if I blow up, if I mill another mountain, I don't even have the first mountain to get. Yeah, I think I'm stopping. I think I'm stopping here. Even if delirium. Nah, it's okay. One more. One more, and now I'm officially stopped. Yeah, all the lava darts are gone. Forever gone. Okay. Hey, that's it. I finished my turn. Pass. I have no clue how many triggers I have. Let's see how many. RA. Six. Seven. Anti cast or something. Uh, seven. Let's draw. We're gonna deck with 12 cards. Good. I didn't even get a. Um, I didn't even get a um, a mountain. So. Oh yeah, I bubble again. <laughs> That's another uh, Urborg. <laughs> I should have not, but it's okay. Okay, I have seven cards in my deck. There's one mountain. It's obviously relevant, because yeah, I just I didn't want to love it art myself for this reason. <laughs> But it probably took a bathroom break, waiting for me. But I was tapped out, so there's no way for me to combo, of course. I don't have Mox Amber Embry. Like other decks. Anyway, this is my Exile Zone right now. Let me check what do I have left in the deck. Uh, Lightning Bolt, it's one, two, three, four. So I have no Lightning Bolts. How many Mutagenic Growth I have left? One, two, so there was one Mutagenic Growth in the deck. That's relevant. Okay, put it begins with demolition field. Fun fact: I cut the mountain for a for a fetch land, and now the mountain is relevant. Okay, so this is my deck. I'll take a screenshot of it. So this is my deck right now, and it consists of well, not great. I guess the Swiss sphere is fine. It's two DRC. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, successfully stripped away blue mana from my from my deck. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. We didn't have a removal spell. Alright, upkeep. By the way, the eight cards I drew, they're like all uncastable. Swift Spear is my draw. Very nice. Um, so I'll uh, remove Swift Spear from my deck. 
So now my deck is these five. Promethogenic growth, I think it's lethal, but I don't think it's worth it to play this now, right? Remember, this art Mesa does nothing. Uh, so I have. So if I go mutagenic growth and upkeep, and I find the mutagenic growth. I think I win, right? Because uh, 6 più 8, poi faccio Monaca, Growth, so I have 8 damage there. No, actually it's not lethal. If I play Mutagenic Growth in Upkeep and draw Mutagenic Growth, I don't have lethal. 6 più 2 8, plus I go Ma Monster Swiss Spear of Mutagenic Growth, that's only plus 4. Oh no, it is lethal. Yeah, so it's exactly lethal if I find Mutagenic Growth. I have 5 cards in my deck. I think it's worth to dig for it right now. I think it's worth to dig for it right now. So I'm gonna go mutagenic growth and upkeep. Because I have two two look plus a draw step. Fail. Find. Draw. Draw. Mountain monasteries with spear. Mutagenic growth on this. This time I'm gonna leave everything on top. Because of uh, of my deck size, I only have three cards in my deck. Combat, attack with all. Nice. Woo! This was a fun game. Wow. Ah, this is a fun game of magic. Thank you, Underworld Breach, for making this fun. Schoolness, <sighs> come on! <laughs> Thank you for the prime sub. Celebrating uh, this nice, uh, the celebrating this nice victory. Yeah, this was a good game. Should I should I put this game first in my in my YouTube video? Probably. This is a very good game. Definitely worth checking out if you're watching this video. All right. Uh, okay. So with this, I'll take a bathroom break. It's definitely draining experience. I'll be back for round number three. It's alright. Thank you, Izorat. Thank you so much. All right. Come back in a minute. Don't go anywhere. Okay, Wonder All Deals. Hello, Ladoya. You bought Ragavan before the... Ooh, Toxic sent me a message. GGVP. Thank you. Uh, the Ragavan will definitely drop in price, yes. I mean, it's magic cards. Magic cards that are not in the reserve list are dropping price. Like, you know, that's it. Like, that's how they're doing these things these days. <laughs> Round number three on the play against M. Chang. My hand is a mulligan. Oh, more, more, more. This perfect, no? Yeah, buy high, never sell. Yeah, that's exactly it. <laughs> you just buy the card that you want to play and you don't bother about its price anymore. Every time I check prices of my cards, they're like so much less than I bought them for. Mulligan. Oh, vamos. Keep. Uh, no lead, dra spread dragon. Yeah, maybe soul scar mage. Now the and only spread dragon. Yeah, let's go. Sacred foundry, dragon's ray channeler. Bubble bubble. And if Ragavan goes down in price, then people might not want to ban it anymore. 
because it makes modern fun and not, it's not just a price okay let's bubble uh, you because I yeah I don't wanna play another bubble oh which I'm so cover right off the top that's everyone's favorite draw step Everyone's favorite draw step, Gemstone Caverns. Hello, Penko. I believe uh, Channel Frabble has a limited um, a set review. Okay, let's suspend crushing footfalls. Draw. Bubble. Under or breach. Hmm. Do I believe in breach here? Maybe do like a mini breach next turn. Is this something? Yeah, maybe. I'll leave it on top. Mini breach. I for one and pass. The pre-release is this Friday, yeah. Unfortunately, I'll be in uh, Berlin, so I I'll be Berlin making videos for uh, car market. I don't think I'll have much much time for pre-release, but uh, I'll definitely play uh, the F and M the next week. You're here to advocate blue eye control on stream. Uh, just just yesterday, I posted the legacy control deck which I think it's the best deck in Legacy right now. So if you're a Control fan and want to break to a different format, check out that video. All right, let's bubble myself. Un oh, I knew it was under... Wait, wasn't I supposed to draw under a breach? Oh! Oh, okay. bad. Not a cozy. Yeah, I was supposed to bubble my because I knew the top card. I was supposed to draw it and then bubble myself. Anyway, no, actually I didn't have bubble anymore. All right, whatever, draw. It's okay. Spread dragon. Okay. Hmm. I missed the bubble trigger. Yeah. <laughs> Online missed the bubble trigger. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. It's okay. I'm checking out different co uh, different topics. All this confusing. Anyway, uh, let's just go spread dragon attack. It's so bad if they have fire eyes though. So bad if they have fire eyes though. So if I go land breach now, just mountain breach, fetch land, how many bubbles can I cast? I probably just one. I don't think it's good. This is diff like this is bad if they have if they have fire eyes is super bad. I guess I'm just ready to die if they have fire eyes. Maybe they're afraid. Of going for it because they have mana up and you know maybe they're afraid opponent are you afraid are you afraid opponent I hope so so this was a mulligan to five by the way I don't really think I can play too much scared all right We untapped at least. They can go for fire rise end of turn. It's not it's not a bad idea. Yeah, that's what they're doing. Yep. Uh, this is better against the uh, removal spell. This is, sorry, against the spell. You want to play silence over spell is in the sideboard? Sure. You can do it. Ashing for falls. Okay, there are 12. 
is very much Oop, reach. Let's go, DRC. And attack. Yeah, not not looking good. Combination of Mulligan to five. Uh, probably also, I don't know how much of a mistake that was. Probably just just not that big of a mistake. Graveyard, resolve. How big is that now? Five six. If you plant the mutagenic growth, it becomes a eight nine. All right. Not bad. Opponent's gonna regret not having blocked with that uh, Charlotte's agent now. Oh, vision of injure. How's it going? Ooh, love it art as well. Very nice. We are playing uh, Just Get Prowess in Modern. The source commit is now an 8-9, so this two Rhinos, 4-4, four, four, will die, will perish. And you can go. All right, pretty good, pretty good turn. And uh, almost at Delirium again. Yeah, just eight uh, to crashing food falls that easily. Hope you had a good stream. Right, getting ready for the new set to come out. Shadow Sage and Buff wouldn't have mattered. It wouldn't matter because I flipped the Lava Dart. Otherwise, it would have because I had an 8 9. Not about, nothing about. Okay. <laughs> the world where I Lava Dart and I get Delirium. There is actually. Do we want, do we want to get lucky? I think so. So I just go Lava Dart, I put a land in the graveyard, and if I hit a sorcery or a creature, I have Delirium. Or do you want to go for it? I think so. I have nothing. That yeah. Let's go. Let's get lucky. Let's get lucky here. I need a sorcery or a creature. Sorcery or a creature. Let's go. Or artifact as well. That yeah. Boom. Ecolali! Bye! Okay. Let's go! That's how you should play the deck on a multi five. Yeah, for sure. Draw. Iteration. Now. Bing! Okay. I'll attack with my DRC and pass. You got an eight. You have the food falls coming out. Okay, mountain. Yeah, I was playing light up the stage in this deck over over Noli Heat. My guy for CFB Pro. Draw. Iteration. Hmm. Am I dead? I think so. I tried so hard, but in the end, it did not matter.
pass. But I'm I'm dead to anything. Is there a way to get CFB Pro if you're a Neo Europe? I don't know if I'm supposed to say this, but VPN should work. I don't even know if it's like, uh, yeah. But that should that should work. But I've never tried. GG. Yeah, I'm dead to any any spell. All right, that's it. I need to draw something good uh, in these two turns and and bricked. That's fine. Uh, we once again have the six mana, the six cards uh, counter spell. Let me see how I sideboard. Lava dart doesn't seem great. Let's see what I say to do. I say to do, first of all, again, name Underwear Breach, Love It Art. Breach Magic Ending. This looks also has a Noni Heat. I think I'll, uh, I'll do something like this. Yeah. No, I was offered a sponsorship by ExpressVPN. Better refuse it. It wasn't, it wasn't. It wasn't much. So, no sponsored by any VPN. I thought to check your credit card. Maybe. I, I don't know. Again, I don't know. Sorry, Chod. Chomic. I, I never... Never tried, so I don't want to tell you to do it. That is uh, my job, though. It's a right article for CFB. It sucks that some of you cannot read them. Although, as I said, um, I have uh, uh, got approved now three free article a month instead of just one. Uh, I posted my uh, blur Merc type in the free section. All right, Zen's not great, but I think it's good enough for the plus of stonks. He tried prowess with Alba Moonlight and Silence and no blue. No blue? As in you don't have expressive iteration in your deck? Sorry. No expressive iteration is a no for me. I feel like I've never drawn the card in my league so far. All right, let's begin. Gems of Cavern, Pitch, Brazen, Borrower. Let's go. Mountain, Swifty. Boris is a better name, Burn, yeah. Lava Spike Gamers. You have turn one dead gone? Sorry, turn zero dead gone? Dead, gone. All right, go. You never run expressive iteration in your Hammer Time decks. I mean, that's why Hammer Time is not succeeding anymore, because it doesn't have expressive iteration. Turn zero, dead, gone over there. I have to respect the turn two Cascade spell, so I can't play Sprite Dragon. I already played with Black White Armor Time yesterday. Scammer Time. Also known as. Clunky Mana! Clunky Mana. I can't go Flash Storm or Outburst and on Shard List because I only have one. One blue. Well, let's hope they don't have to cascade spell, but just one. Oh, it's endurance. Hey, hello, I'm a bean. Yesterday, I cube draft with Omnath. So fun to cube draft with Omnath. I should have. I should have deck picked later. It was a very fun deck list. Alright, 
and tap and draw. Mamma mia, che schifo! Uh. Yeah, silence might be better than spell tears. I mean, now I would love to have silence. Draw. Draw. Alright, that's a that's a piece of cardboard I can click on at least. Man, the, the fear of my opponent deck is so big. Like I can never never tap that wooded foothills to receive a amount of person response. Go to eleven. Oh, they're doing something. What is it? Blue green. Is that Charles? Okay. I got eight. Which is not very much. And I'll flash the stonk this. Same target. Maybe they had mystical dispute. I don't know. And once again, flash the stonk does not go under mystical dispute. All right, but they have a two-two in play. Draw for turn. Ski fall. I can't move. He can have his six spells in hand and just can't cast any of them. They are mana base is not good. I no, don't know how to fix this, honestly. Alright, so I could go mutagenic graph. I feel like I feel like I have to. I feel like the more this game goes on, the worse it's gonna get. So I'm just gonna go block and do this. I obviously gonna go shock and then under shard list and I can't do anything about it. But if you have like a two mana card, I can flash a storm it. Oh, force of negation you had. Okay. Uh, well, I guess I can still pierce this. Not F6. Since I don't have any other card to cast. Okay, seems like this worked well. For me, I think they have mystical dispute in end. Yeah, that's good. That was a good trade. I'm happy about it. That three cards in end. I'm afraid of fury now. Oh man, go mad on me, I'm gonna so. Oh, mommy, I could do these draws, these draws, these draws are so painful. I have to pass. That's <laughs> Oh, 
And maybe the solution is to not play white. I think the solution is just to get luckier. I think that's the that's the solution. Let's get luckier. I lost to Lidingand and Cascade and, and Rhinos, the two Cascade decks. Of course, the league is long, so I can keep on losing. But this is, uh, yeah, a sign maybe that the matchup is, is really, really bad. If you are now. Yes, this is Frackham's list. Oh, my lava dart. Yes, this one is supposed to make died. I can go breach, so it's gonna make, and then I can do something. Yeah, let's do that. Three mana, so it's gonna make. Here we go. Here we go. Mm. I'm likely that they don't have anything, but could be. Okay, I'll block, I'll play Love at Art and Fury. And I'll uh, flash it back. And I'll flash it back. I'm doing something with is this this is a meme skill dispute? Yeah. Alright. So it's a it's a trade. And I go to two life. Right, draw. Let's draw a lightning bolt. Bubble. Okay. Spray dragon bubble. And I'll bubble you. And pass. Dead gone. Um, not dead yet. I might draw a lightning bolt. For this. Might as well attack since I have dead gone on top. Draw, let's see if there's a lightning bolt. Alright, GG.
Okay, round number four again, psycho-emotion. You're the only one that loses with rhinos? Yeah, rhinos always win. Uh, Alright, key, five lands and spells. One of my lands to five. But I didn't need uh, the white land so far in this league. Urza's mine, okay. We're playing against the Urza's mine, chat. Then DRC go. Next one I can go. Swiss Fear, Lava Dark. Maybe. Wow, two Urs is mine. This is Chalice? No. Okay. I'll go Swiss Fear. I'll go Love Dart. I guess I should have gone Love Dart first. Took this land since I'm gonna get uh, the Gigant at this turn. I don't want to play Iteration. Wars of Saga, yay yay. Was that this member? Okay. Ooh, good draw. The Sprite Dragon. Well, it passes. Let's go. Iteration. Do I find a bubble? If I find a bubble, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> Putting one drops, okay. And bottom exile. I'll play Lava Dart. I'll play Mutagenic Growth. Back for four. I have Lava Dart. Next, next turn, if they don't do anything, I guess they can probably exile my graveyard. Nah, they probably won't. Probably won't play around Breach. Yeah, we have Prismatic Ending as an answer to the Chalice. And I feel like a pithy needle on my wooded foothills. You're welcome. They got Shadow Spear. Ray! Bazeju. Am I lethal next turn? Probably. Draw. Draw. Let's go on the world breach. Eh. What else? I mean, this should be it, right? Like I go, mutagenic growth. Mutagenic growth. Love it art. Actually, let's play iteration first. I don't know why I didn't start with iteration in the first place. Oh, 
Well, I guess first I have to lava dart. Yeah, I have it. That's lethal. Yeah, because I flash back lava dart, and that's 10. We got there exactly! <laughs> nice! Nice! Exactly life and damage. Like my life and your life. Nice. Oh, look, do I want this path to exiles? But... Alright, bad cards. Uh, I guess I need to take out some of these one drops. Do this. Four prismatic ending to wear tear. Hopefully that's enough. Yeah, the I mean just classic magic, right? The wins are fun, the losses are not fun. Alright, that's not good. This one. Hey man, this hand is awful. Keep. I can I can go to five. Somewhat functional if I drop lanes. That's not planes. I think I'll bubble at least once. And keep the second one for Spray Dragon. If I dismember, okay. Get forest. Planes? Hmm is a card. Okay, planes. Hmm. Oh, Capitana, the worst possible draw there. Alright, 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 easy game, easy game, easy game. Thank you, opponent. I enjoy playing fast magic. A game three on the play. Eep. And sucks, but I'm tired of modeling into five or opening hands that are that are awful. I'm excited about Mom. Uh, Mom, as in the new set called Mother of the Machine. Yeah, sure. I like I like new set of Magic. That's why I play Magic over other games. New sets are fun. Okay. These member. Is it serious? Okay. Elishnor dies in the new set. Oh, that's the lore. Elishnor dies. Sorry. Elishnor fans. Complete duration. Park of the Genovis people. First game before Zero Lands this game six. Oh. oh. There will not be a fifth match, chat. My mood is too low on this. I can't continue after this game. Let's return Jaggy. Hey, 
you play Chalice in that deck? Like, you must got so lucky. And I also lost. My pensate. My pensate. Uh, I'm metal, oh, no. I'm pitching. Yeah, yeah, uh, um, car market video, uh, when I go there, will be about, um, a lot, they said so many, they, are, they got so many people submitting 100 euro decks, and uh, if I can beat them, if they can beat me with Merc Tide, they'll, uh, they'll take, the uh, car market will ship the deck. So, yeah, hopefully it's not like, I don't know. Unfun decks that are just made to beat Merktide, but just I don't know, functional deck. Five five. Can you beat that? I'm actually struggling in beating that with your four mana Karn. You got relic. Oh, I want to bold the card and attack face. I think that's more damage. Bleeding stonks. I have lethal in hand. I just go for lethal. I think so. After seven. Old to you. <laughs> this is like such a bad game. Such a bad game. Like, I don't know. A standard deck would have easily beat me, but Tron with main deck chalices and Amelia one drop did not defeat me. Poor Tron. All right, I guess I guess we are playing around five. I thought it was impossible to win this game, but I guess my opponent really did very little. Giganta beat down versus Tron. That's not what you expect usually. Tron's not what it used to be. Well, if they maybe play, I don't know. I don't want to say too much about them. Hey, Ladoa, they just pick one. They don't pick you 100%. They'll pick the person that I think makes the most interesting video. But yeah, that was the idea. If you follow me on Twitter, you would have read this yesterday. This was their advertisement. It was... Uh, once again, if your 100 euro deck beats a Merc died, we'll send this straight to you. Liga rules to it longer. We are giving away a modern deck. Simply build a 100 euro, take a screenshot of your shopping cart on card market, and etc. I don't know. They're probably just limited to Europeans. Alright, final round. My hand is unkeepable as always. Okay, this is slightly more keepable. They didn't write anything legal modern deck? Ooh. Nah, there's a tweet longer or something else. Somewhere else, so probably. They made the, the better rules there. Okay. Uh, I think I'll bottom on only heat. Let's go. Well, you can submit a non modern legal deck. They will not choose it, probably. <laughs> Ah, 
very good. Google, what you got? Ooh, El Paladino. Okay, you're playing against Hammer. Lane's drum and go. Okay. All right, Mango, please give me a land. Deck, please give me a land. Die, Terra. No, 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 Terra. Mm. Vamos. Sacred Foundry. This. I can go mutagenic growth, and if I find. Um, If I find a creature or sorcery, I'll get Delirium. I can pass. Play with Genic Growth and Upkeep. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I was too busy complaining that uh, you just can't play well, honestly. You can't play well whenever whenever you're so mad at something, you can't play well. It's unfortunately how it goes. Alright, so the ones give her mm. Okay, draw. Okay, let's go express iteration. That's the Lyrim. Graveyard. Let's see what I find. Love it our mutagenic growth. Okay. Uh what do I want here? Probably just keep mutagenic growth, yeah. So I'm gonna go hand, bottom, exile, play land. Uh tap with both. I don't know how much damage is this, but I think it's a lot of damage. Right? I just get a mountain here. Now I go Alura. Mutagenic Growth it's three. Lava Dart it's four. Ciao sette più sei tredici. Cazzo, so close. I guess I can middle another Lava Dart to win. You think it's fourteen exactly? Is it? I don't think so. Mutagenic Growth is three. And Lava Dart is four. Right? That you say Yeah. And I can and I have to care about my opponent because they can't go paladin hammer next turn and kill me. Because I'm on eleven. Alright, let's begin with this. If I mill a lava dart, then it's lethal. And now I pass, because I need to keep up Dart, I think. Yeah, so you take 9 and it's your turn. I have to keep up Dart as a removal spell for the giver. Go. I wish I didn't shock here. If I didn't shock here, I would have just got a mountain. I could have. I would have not died to the Hummer. one blocker because both of my creatures fly why don't kill the giver now uh no i don't think so they passed okay on top draw not bad Uh, 
Okay. I don't want to lower roll your opponent, but you know I have him, so yeah. Our tears, Alpine Moon, Ending, Pa. Let me see how his sideboard in the article. Breach, Light of the Stage, Mid Beginning Growth. Okay, so I don't have a uh, Light of the Stage anymore. I got one Breach. Three cards extra to side out. Bad can't be the darts, can't be the bolts. This is the case of over sideboarding, could be all right. Let's cut the channelers. We yeah, have Sanctifier, although we have a lot of removals before. Let's go. It's a wall ender, but it's a keep. Plains Esper Sentinel is my opponent's start. Not a bad one. Uh, I think I'll accept you getting a draw. Because I want to bubble myself. Fetch. And kill the Sentinel. With Lava Dart. This way I... You know, opt you to find a second lane with Bubble. As well as kill your Sentinel. Still don't find it, but obviously you should try it your best. Bad the day. Yeah. Nice. What you know for the day? Thank you for the 16 month. Welcome, welcome. Let's go. Think of Steam Vents. Let's play Swift Spear and Lion Bolt. And attack for two. Of course, Sigarda's aiding played scary, but we have ending four, maybe. We'll see. Okay, they pass without a play. Very good. Draw. More lands. Excellent. I can go Mountain, Swiss Spear, ending on the Sigarda. Yeah. Tap for four and then play Soulstar Mage. What's that? March? March? Are you marching over my creature? Yes. Okay. Soulscar, go. <sighs> they pass. Okay. Bro. Okay. Uh, how much damage is this? And the thing is that they might have March, so I don't want to... I don't want to... Even if I have lethal, I don't want to go for it. So returning Gigant and pass. All right, yep, yeah, we have another March. And it's certainly not lethal now, so. I don't even bother counting. Let's pick up this Giganta, which, yeah, I become relevant, as always. Uh, 
Okay. Draw. Love it art and pay for the tax. Uh, yes. Attack. They, I think they played Espes, they always had Espes Sentinel, they just played it because they wanted me to blow up a land to not play Giganta. But I don't want to do it. All right, draw, iteration, oops, misclicked. There was a small lag in my upkeep. That's okay, oh, I definitely missed some damage, but that's all right, I still drew iteration that I called for. Okay, and bottom, exile. You wonder what's in their hand. It could be honestly X ones in the, in face of my loud arts. Relic. Uh. Okay. Is it worth it to dart now? If I dart. I don't play Gigant anymore, but next turn I can go Swift Spear, Bolt you, how much damage it is. Save you 39. Well, actually, it is lethal, so yeah. Goodbye, Giganta. All right, so ended up going three and two, which is obviously not the worst, but the two losses were against Cascade decks. So yeah, dry your conclusion. Dr dr drive? No, how do you say? Uh, draw? Draw your conclusions about that. Like, might need more of these. I did a better amount of base to cast these, I did silence. Yeah. Thank you all for watching. And uh, I'll be back uh, every day with a YouTube video. So like, subscribe, leave a comment to stay tuned and uh, have a good one.